Hey guys, welcome. Like many of them have asked me to discuss about the subjects that are needed for VLSA job preparation. So generally, while coming to VLSA jobs, you will be at least as a fresher, you will be listening about two types. Like one is digital, another one is analog. And there are many profiles if you see in digital and the same thing applies to analog. There are many profiles here and here. But as a fresher, you will be tested with only basics because you won't be having any experience, right? So they will be testing what you have studied till you are B.Tech or in your M.Tech like these basic things. So for this, what are the subjects you need to prepare? So these things I am going to discuss now. So first we will see with digital. And the references which I am giving now. All these things I have like I have searched many references and I have taken the best in them. So basically the reference should be in such a way that it should be very easy to understand. And at the same time it should be detailed also. Detailed and correct. So these things should be there. So while coming to digital you need to prepare like two things. One is digital ICT design and the second one is very long. And you can also do one advanced course digital system design. I will give references for all of this just a second. Yeah, first while coming to digital IC design, like there are many differences available in YouTube. What I personally like is the videos from Professor Bagbar Machari. He is from IIT Kanpur. He simplifies these concepts in such a way that even a beginner can understand it very clearly. Believe me, just go through his videos, you will be done with this course. And while coming to Verilog, you can refer videos of Professor Indranil Sen Gupta. He is from IIT Karakpur. You can just type very log professor Indranil Sen Gupta on YouTube and you will be getting his videos. If you are done with these two things, this is a little bit advanced course. If you have time, you can go through this. This is like this course is offered by Professor Kuruvilla Vargis. He is from IISC. So this is about digital. Now in your CV you also need to upload some projects right. Mainly they will first test your basics and after that they will go into the projects. What you have done in that project these things they will test. So while coming to the projects I will give you two projects from architecture to very log coding these two are more than enough but please learn them perfectly like each and every detail so the first project is like pipeline implementation
of risk processor. And all the details about this project is available in the videos of Professor Indranil Sen Gupta. Like there are I think 41 videos. In the last 5 to 6 videos, he will teach this project. So please learn it thoroughly. Next. Second project is like Asynchronous before design. And this project is available at I think mm, yeah got it Sunburst design the author is Clifford Cummings if possible I will search once and provide the link So if you do these two projects that will be more than enough and this Clifford Cummings, the Sunburst design, they also provide some most important papers on Verilog regarding each and every concept like FSM design, regarding resets, like everything. So you can go through those papers also if you have time. But try to complete these things. So as a fresher, for sure you will land in a digital job if you do these things. Next, what about analog? So let me minimize this besides yes. So analog. In this you need to prepare two things. One is analog basic and another one is analog advanced. If you go through the basics, there are famous videos of Behzad Rajavi. They are available on YouTube. You can search Professor Behzad Rajavi. So there are basically two videos, electronics one and electronics two. One more thing is in electronics one there are two lectures like one is for BJT, one is for MOSFET. You can neglect BJT and you can start preparing from MOSFET it's okay but if you have time you can go through both the things so for the basic you need to complete these two videos once you are done with this you can see some advanced course which is offered by professor nagendra krishnapura so the course name is like analog ic design by Professor Nagendra Krishnapura. He is from IIT Madras. Right. So if you if you are done with these three things and for sure you will be getting an analog job and while coming to the references like which books you need to follow. So first thing is try to complete all these lectures. After that you can follow these books. So while coming to the analog references are like basically there is only one reference. Design of analog CMOS integrated circuits. This is by Professor Behazad Rajavi. So this book is more than enough.
not only in the interview process but while doing job also this books helps a lot and in this there are some topics like band gap regulator circuits pls oscillators any one circuit you can study you can mention it as a small project kind of thing so this is for analog while coming to digital references are like this is introduction to verilog and digital design by morris mano i think yeah digital design with intro to verilog this is by professor morris mano yeah that's it guys these are all the references that you need to follow to get a job just remember one thing if you are good with your basics but still you are not able to answer some advanced questions or questions in some projects then it's okay they will still consider taking you but let us say you have done 10 20 projects but you still missed a basic question believe me they will reject you for sure so be good with the basics and as a fresher whatever be the profile front end back end verification physical design whatever be the thing they will only ask you basics if you are good with it they will take you so yeah all the best guys if you need some any guidance or kind of thing you can ask me in the comment section i will try to make a video bye bye